Nigerian kids from some of the most affluent and disadvantaged communities in Lagos are telling stories about their lives and communities through a photo exhibition meant to help educate people about the extreme poverty gap in Africa's most populous nation. Well, one part of the project is to bring awareness for children around Lagos, you know, to be aware that there's some children who are less fortunate than themselves and you develop the whole empathy, empathy process. Around 200 children from a private school in the exclusive Ikui district and orphanage and a school near Awaya, one of the slum areas of Lagos, were given cameras for a weekend to take pictures of their homes and environment. There were a lot of mistakes when I was taking the pictures, like the flash, it, it, it was very, it was quite hard because the flash, it kept going off. These young aspiring photographers between the age of 7 and 14 displayed more than 400 of their best images at a culture center in Lagos. The exhibition is the first of its kind in this area meant to bring together kids from diverse backgrounds and remind people that their city is a tale of two cities. I took pictures of something like um, food we eat, even leaves, green leaves that live around us, even water that live around us, even goats and animals and other things. Take pictures of them. The photos show extreme life in Lagos, a vast city of 14 million people, where some of Africa's most expensive real estate, inhabited by oil tycoons and bankers, sits alongside wooden huts built on stilts over a lagoon. This project was set up to stimulate intellectual potential of children from both privileged and unprivileged backgrounds. Some of the kids who did extremely well in the competition will also be given tuition to do basic training in photography. Paul Ndiho reporting in Washington.